Hi, I'm Dr. Jessica Getty, a dermatologist here at Starling Physicians. Today I want to share some information about skin cancer, including warning signs that you can look for and factors that may put you at risk for skin cancer. Skin cancer is on the rise at alarming rates and affects people of all age, lifestyle, and skin color. Cancer of the skin is by far the most common of all types of cancer. In the United States, one in five people will be diagnosed with skin cancer during their lifetime. It is estimated that over 178,000 cases of melanoma will be diagnosed in 2018, and about 9,500 people are diagnosed with skin cancer every day. Melanoma rates have doubled since 1982, and currently there are more than 1 million Americans living with melanoma. Though skin cancer usually affects people with older age, melanoma commonly occurs in young people. In fact, it is the most common cancer occurring in women aged 15 to 29. The three most common types of skin cancer are basal cell carcinoma, squamous cell carcinoma, and melanoma. Basal cell and squamous cell carcinoma, collectively known as the non-melanoma skin cancers, are the most common and tend to favor areas of sun-exposed skin, including the scalp, face, ears, hands, and back. Although melanoma accounts for less than 1% of all skin cancers, it is more dangerous than the non-melanoma skin cancers because it can spread to other areas of the body or metastasize if it is not treated early. There are a number of factors that can increase your risk for skin cancer. Risk factors for all types of skin cancer include exposure to UV light, older age, and fair skin, people with more than 50 moles, especially large or atypical moles, a family history of melanoma in a blood relative, a previous diagnosis of any type of skin cancer, a history of blistering sunburns, and a weakened immune system. The good news is that with regular screening, skin cancer, including melanoma, can be detected. Detecting skin cancer early can lead to more treatment options and better outcomes. I usually recommend monthly self-exams at home to look for new concerning spots or changes in your existing moles. Basal cell carcinoma usually presents as a pearly pink bump, whereas squamous cell carcinoma can present as a rough red scaly patch or a sore that will not heal. Melanoma can arise from new or existing moles. The warning signs for melanoma can be easily remembered with the acronym ABCDE. A is for asymmetry, B is for borders, C is for color, anything very dark in color or multiple colors. D is for diameter or size greater than six millimeters. And E is for evolution or any other change in size, shape, or symptoms. Regular skin exams with your dermatologist are also important, especially if you are at higher risk, like people with a previous history of skin cancer or a family history of melanoma in a blood relative. If you have a concerning spot, your dermatologist can do a biopsy to determine if the spot is skin cancer. A biopsy is a minimally invasive, quick, safe, and easy in-office procedure that can usually be performed the same day as your exam. There are many treatment options available if you are diagnosed with skin cancer. Early detection is the key to improving outcome and overall survival. The five-year survival rate for people whose melanoma is detected before it spreads to the lymph nodes is 99%. That survival rate drops to 65% if the melanoma has already spread to the lymph nodes. Here at Starling Physicians, we work closely with our surgery and oncology departments to coordinate care for these more advanced cases. Non-melanoma skin cancer can also be treated with excision, but there are other options available, including short in-office procedures and sometimes topical medications. While skin cancer can't always be prevented, there are a number of steps that you can take to reduce your risk and protect your skin. Prevention strategies can include minimizing sun exposure by seeking shade, wearing protective clothing, applying a generous amount of broad spectrum sunscreen with an SPF of 30 or higher, remembering to reapply sunscreen every two hours, taking extra precautions near water, sand, and snow, and avoiding tanning beds. If you have noticed any concerning spots, our dermatologists here at Starling Physicians are your experts for skin cancer management. We perform regular full body skin exams and routinely treat all types of skin cancer. A diagnosis of skin cancer can be very overwhelming. Our team is here to walk you through the initial steps of diagnosis and coordinate a treatment plan that works for you. Visit starlingphysicians.com for more information.